Jake Dozer here, Certified Financial Planner and Financial Advisor on the team here at Johnson Burnetti. And we're here with our Money Wisdom Question Series. Today's question is, how do I save taxes in retirement? As the question suggests, getting tax savings in retirement starts before retirement, if you can at all help it. And the first thing you need to be discerning is how am I contributing to my retirement accounts? Of course, there are two options in that space. You can make pre-tax contributions. What that means is you're lowering your income tax by writing off the, the, the tax contributions you're making to your retirement account, and you're paying the taxes later. It's called tax deferral. Or the opposite is true as well. You could choose Roth, which is I'm paying the taxes now, I'm getting it out of the way and I'm choosing to grow tax-free going forward. There is not a right or wrong answer, but there is one that is unique to your circumstance. Depending on what's your income like today, what's your income going to be like tomorrow, what are tax brackets going to change in the future? Some of those things are within your control and some aren't, but making an educated, informed plan based on the professional with whom you're working is gonna be your best bet on making sure that the lever that you can pull of contributions towards retirement are being um, putting you in a position to be most successful in retirement. The second decision is, how am I taking money out of my retirement accounts and the accounts that I have outside of me? You have to make decisions on timing. Am I, am I taking Social Security and my pension and withdrawing from a retirement account at the same time? Well, you're tapping three different taxable areas, and that means you're gonna be paying taxes on all those withdrawals. Maybe you wanna start staggering your withdrawals. Maybe you want to take retirement account withdrawals uh, from one place and pause the withdrawals from another place. Maybe you want to be taking a combination of non-retirement account withdrawal assets, such as money at the bank or in a brokerage account, along with your retirement account withdrawals. Maybe another thing you should be thinking about is Roth conversions. Am I proactively getting ahead of the taxes by taking money from my pre-tax accounts and moving it into a Roth retirement account? The idea again there is just like the contribution, I'm paying the taxes now so that I can grow tax-free for the remaining time that that money is in my retirement account. So decision one, how am I contributing? Decision two, what's the timing of my withdrawals? Decision three, amongst many others of course, is am I considering Roth conversions? Make sure that you're making these decisions and you're measuring twice and cutting once as they say. Make sure that you're also making these decisions under the informing and advisement of the professional with whom you're working because these are decisions they can't go back on. Again, I hope today's content was helpful for you. Jake Dozer here, Certified Financial Planner with our Money Wisdom Question Series. If it was, give this video a like. And if you feel that someone else might benefit from it, share it. And we'd love to see you next time. Yeah.